Good morning, everyone. Book number 52. Joseph had a little overcoat by Sims Tabak. We had Mr. Tabak as the illustrator of a story, and I said I had a book where he would be both author and illustrator, and this is the one. And it won the Caldecott Medal the year it was published. Joseph had a little overcoat. See all kinds of tools. Joseph had a little overcoat. I got some notes here. Joseph had a little overcoat. He wore the coat for a long time and then something happened to it. And there's a moral too. Sometimes the authors trick you and put some stuff before the first page of the story. There's Joseph and his overcoat. I see a turkey and a goose and a cat and a rooster and some chickens. I think Joseph lives on a farm. That would be the setting of our story, on a farm. Joseph had a little overcoat. It was old and worn. So there's a hole in here. Kind of like on There Was an Old Lady Who Swallowed a Fly. And it changes the picture. So here's his overcoat that's old and worn. You can see all his patches. And I turn the page and it's not the old worn overcoat anymore. So he made a jacket out of it. And he went to the fair. Joseph had a little jacket. And it got old and worn. There's patches on the sleeves. Oh, he's been milking the cow. What are we going to do with it this time? There's the hole. So he made a vest out of it. And he danced at his nephew's wedding. Joseph had a little vest. It got old and worn. Over here is a menorah. That means Joseph probably is Jewish. He's getting ready to celebrate maybe Hanukkah. Oh, there's the new hole. Huh, he's got a vest. We're going to change it to, so he made a scarf out of it. And he sang in the men's chorus. Joseph had a little scarf. It got old and worn. Ooh. Do you see the hole there? Can you tell what shape that is? What did he turn his scarf into? So he made a tie out of it. And he went to visit his married sister in the city. So Joseph lives in a rural area, which is what we call the area of a farm. And his sister lives in an urban area, which we call a city. Those are our social studies words. Joseph had a little necktie. It got old and worn. Whoa, see the little hole there? So he made a handkerchief out of it. And he drank a glass of hot tea with lemon.
Joseph had a little handkerchief. It got old and worn. I don't know if you can see this hole. It's right here. So he made a button of it. And he used it to fasten his suspenders. Joseph had a little button. One day he lost it. Now he had nothing. So Joseph made a book about it, which shows you can always make something out of nothing. Dear readers, as a child, I had a favorite song, a Yiddish folk song called I Had a Little Overcoat. Many years ago, I adapted the song to make a book, and I called it Joseph Had a Little Overcoat. Some people noticed that Joseph looked a lot like me. Now you know that no artist is ever satisfied with his work, but usually we don't get to do it over. So I'm particularly happy to be publishing this newly illustrated version of Joseph. I hope that all of you who wrote to me about the early version will take this one to your hearts. That would prove that you can't always make something out of nothing over and over again. Sims Tabak. Oh, and here's a copy of the song. I don't know this melody. Maybe I know somebody that plays guitar and maybe we can figure it out and sing it. Joseph had a little overcoat by Sims Tabak.